of Beauty by Elle. I'm Isabel. Welcome back and welcome all my new subscribers. I hope you guys are having a beautiful, beautiful day. It is so pretty outside lately um, here in Arizona. It's awesome. Um, if you hear something in the background, that's just, um, that is Iris. She is right here. She's playing with a box that I gave her so she won't chew up my, my cords <laughs> in here. But anyways, um, I wanted to come today to, and give you guys a review on the Moon River brushes that I just received. Now, I first learned about Moon River brushes through a YouTuber that I watch. Her name is Esperanza's Charm. I did um, a channel of the month on her and uh, I was watching her video and she did these uh, this video on the Moon River brush brushes re review. And so I thought, you know, I, that's kind of cool. So I wanted to try them. So I got the link from her channel, um, you know, that she linked below. I will go ahead and put her, uh, that link to the video that she did on the Moon River brushes down below. So you guys can go take a look at her. I really do like her channel and enjoy it very, very much. She's very, very good at explaining everything, um, you know, in, in products that she, she reviews and things like that. Anyways, um, boy, um, my shirt's wrinkly today. I don't know. I think it's just this shirt. Anyways, <laughs> I'm getting off the subject. Um, <clears throat> I did contact them. I did contact Moon River Cosmetics, and I asked them if they could send me some brushes for review and a really nice lady named Kim whom I was talking to she went ahead and told me um, what brushes I wanted to review I told her I only wanted five so she did send me the five brushes that I requested plus she sent me this really really pretty case isn't that pretty it's got like a little moon right here with stars I don't know if you guys can see that and uh, it does open up like this, you know, so you could put it in on your vanity. And here are the brushes that I requested. But I put them in here, and so you could put it on your vanity. Now, the brushes, um, let me tell you a little bit about, about them. They do have a 30-day uh, money-back guarantee, um, and it is a full refund if you are unhappy with the brushes. And, and there's no questions asked if you guys are unhappy with them or whatnot. So I like that. That's pretty nice, you know. And all the brushes are made out, the, the handles are made out of solid wood. Okay, this right here is all solid wood. And it does have the Moon River logo on them. Just like that. Okay, and the ferrule here is double crimped. And it is, um, it is aluminum, um, it's a non-corrosive aluminum so that it doesn't get uh, corroded, things, you know, when you wash it. <clears throat> and it also, it is double crimped so that it prevents it from shedding. And they all come, show you how they came. They came in a little pouch like this, which I really appreciate that. Um, so, you you know, it has a little Ziploc thing on it, okay, and then the brush came in here, and then it does, um, they all came with a brush guard that looks like this, okay, which is really nice because I use the brush guards when I wash my, when I wash my brushes, I, you know, usually wash them and then um, I put them in the brush guard to keep their shape and then I stand them up against, you know, something like this so that they, they can, all the water can just drip down or it does it go into the ferrule, okay? So let me tell you what I got and the brushes. Okay, the first brush I got was, is this is it, this is a white blending brush. And this one retails for $7.95. And uh, this is what it looks like. Okay. This one is made out of goat hair. 
it is a it is a really nice brush it does blend really 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 well and it does hold the product pretty good and it really well actually and it does blend out the product very very nicely okay I have another I have it compared to now I don't want to compare it to a Sigma or a uh, a um, like a Mac brush because that's a different price range I wanted to keep it in the same price range and because this one is $7.95 I wanted to keep it within you know around that price range. anyways the, the comparison so this one is the one I got from the BH cosmetic a rose gold collection and this is what that one looks like now the way they describe this one is um, they don't really go much in the description on their brushes which is kind of odd to me so they, they consider this one a soft fluffy bristle brush and that's all I got from that soft fluffy bristle brush and uh, this one retails for three dollars and ninety five cents <throat> and this one is seven dollars and ninety five cents for the extra couple dollars I would rather have this one because uh, for one thing I have washed these several times used them several times and not one time has this brush ever shed it has not shed on me um, even when I wash it um, use it or anything like that it has not shed on me not once which is really awesome you know compared to this one and this one has shed a little bit um, not a lot I have to be fair it hasn't shed a lot but just a little bit and the fact that they don't really tell you what the you know just a fluffy bristle brush mm, you know kind of tells you you wonder what it's from you know what it is so that's the first brush I got. <clears throat> the second brush I got is um, the medium angled brush, which is this one here. This one, um, medium angled brush. This one retails for $7.95 and it is horse hair bristles. Okay, the horse hair bristles like this. And it's more for control and it does you know, it, it gives you a really, really good blending action there. And I really like this brush, especially if you have a hooded eye, because you can put this like you can find your crease and then see that angle there. Then you could put it here and then do it here, like, like just blend it upwards, just like that. And then you'll crease, you'll get a crease that'll show up right above your natural crease so that it can give you the illusion of a crease okay um, so again I have washed this one several times and it has not shed on me now this one I would compare it to again this is the BH cosmetic one that I got from the rose gold collection okay and see the difference in in the the bristles this one's really thin okay this one I, is synthetic. I this one is good for creams um, and uh, cream shadows, but it, it but it, does, it but it's not really good for for blending. So I really like this brush for for the blending part of it for that reason. Okay, the next one I got is a um, is a angled contour brush. <coughs> Okay, this one is also made out of goat hair, okay, and I have washed this and it has not shed on me, and I really like, it does pick up a lot of product, so you've got to be really careful when you're dipping it into your blush, and so you just got to just really lightly, and it does apply very, very nicely, and it does blend it out very nicely and I also use this for I have used this for contouring you know for here and I like the angle too because you can do it right in here for the angle or here it, it's it's not as soft I would say as the BH cosmetic one but this one it is this one is synthetic and this one is not this one's 
is real hair. Okay, so the next one I got is the tapered blending brush. This one, oh, okay, so this one, sorry about that, I forgot to tell you how much it was. This one um, is $7.95, goat hair. This one is also $7.95 and a small tapered blending brush. Now this one I would probably compare it to the shape of the um, Sigma one that I really, really like, the pointy one. But this one is really, really nice to use for that effect as well. So you go into the V. Oh my gosh, you see my doggy? Okay, so I really like this for the outer V, okay? Or even for down here, if you gotta put some um, eyeshadow down right here. So this is a really nice one as well. Now the last one, the last brush I got was the Flat Top Kabuki brush. Um, this one is synthetic fibers, okay? So it's got, it's okay dense, you know, it's not real dense, but, but it's okay. Um, now this one I do like for uh, cream contouring. Like if, you've, if you're going to contour with some cream, it does spread really nicely here, okay? Or even for powder contouring. Now I have used it for contouring and I have used it, sorry about my dogs, and I have used it for um, foundation. Now the foundation, I find that it's, it's a little bit um, too soft to stipple, but if, if you're real sensitive, uh, if you've got real sensitive skin, then it probably, it probably be okay for you. But I do find that if you buff it, it does seem to work a little bit better when you're doing the buff better that way. But, um, but that's what I use this one for. And also it is the same materials as, you know, what I said before. Okay, so I am really very much enjoying these brushes for the price. Now this one, um, retails for um, $9.95. <laughs> so that's a really nice deal for this brush here. Um, now, now compared to the BH Cosmetic brushes, to the, I think these are a really good um, quality brush. Um, even if you're on a budget, if you're not on a budget, um, if you're looking for a really nice brush um, that does the job, um, this I think these are really nice. Now I will link uh, the Moon River Cosmetics down below so you guys can go take a look at the website and tell me what you think. You know, you can look it up for yourself. Sorry about my dog. Um, she's playing. Um, so yeah, you guys. So that's that's my review on the Moon river cosmetics if now if you guys want a little bit more um more if you guys want to see more brushes in review go check out esperanza's charm um review that she did on these brushes she got a couple more than i did a few more than i did actually so um which is awesome so you guys can go take a look at her channel to see what you guys think anyways that is it for today. I'm sorry about Iris. She's being, oh my gosh, she's being a pill. So, <laughs> but that's what puppies do, right? They're, they bite everything, you guys. Everything. <laughs> Anyways, thank you guys for stopping in to look at my video. Remember to um, subscribe, like, comment, and um, share. And don't forget about my giveaway, you guys. I do have a giveaway right here. This really, it's in the bag right now, but um, I will link the giveaway video below and I will announce the winner Friday, or I will announce the winner on Instagram and Facebook on the 11th. Okay? Till then, have a beautiful, colorful day. I'm gonna go see my puppies. Eat! Bye! <laughs> Subscribe! <laughs> Oh my gosh. <laughs>